How's it going squad? Hope you're all keeping well and welcome to today's 30 minute muscle building, tone and sculpt workout. You can perform absolutely anywhere to really help add that progressive overload into our training and routine. Now it's been a while since we have performed three sets for each exercise and we're going to do that on today's session. There's many benefits of adding in the three sets. It adds progressive overload into your training routine, you're targeting the muscle group in a better way than it's used to. Say it's normally used to one set or two sets, now you're hitting it with that extra momentum to therefore push forward with your goals of strength, shaping off the muscle, sculpting it, and really just adding that overall uh, better benefit to your training routine. The only thing about it, you may feel it's a bit slower paced because it is three sets. However, I want you to focus as if this is a full gym session. You're going in, you're performing your set, you're resting 20 seconds, then you go again. And you try to push your body with that heavier weight if possible. If not, go lighter, bring the intensity. This session is brilliant no matter what your goal is, but if you can push that heavier weight, you're really gonna see that extra benefits with this session. So, if you have access to the bench, grab it. If not, perform any variation. You can go on the ground or without the bench. But the first one is three sets of chest press. Okay, let's try to lift that heavier weight. Warm up now if you need to. The full session is laid out below. 15 second countdown. Let's get into that. Three sets for each. Okay, get ready. Three, two, one, let's go. Focus on good reps, focus on good form. Push out the reps, let's go. Lovely. <clears throat> Take your 20 seconds recovery and we go again. It's the beautiful thing about these three sets, you're adding that progressive overload into your routine. Right, ready to go again. So these are compound exercises, meaning you're targeting multiple muscle groups. Ha, ah, in the formula really. Ten seconds. Dig deep. Good. And you're only really resting 20 seconds, which isn't long. That's why you're getting fatigued quicker with this style of training. Okay, 10 seconds here. Right, ready? Last set of chest press. Come on. A few more reps. Oh, so good. Okay, the next one is the front squat. So if you do two dumbbells, you can double it up. If you have the one weight, one heavier weight, grab it and do your squats like so. Move this up the road. Okay, let's get ready. Just gonna go up. High with the weight. Yeah. 
Let's go. 15 seconds. Three more. Three, two, one. Good. Woo! Feel the burn. Okay, second set, let's go. Twenty seconds. Dig deep. Eight to fifteen reps is the target here. Hold the weight with them front lunges, front squats, sorry. Whew. Right, five seconds, ready to go. Three, two, one, last set of these. That third set makes the difference. Go on. A few more reps. Go on, 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Good, switch on. Let's keep it moving. Not easy, but it's worth it. Let's go. That's all we got. Okay, T row is next. Holding the one dumbbell with two hands, rolling up and in, targeting that feet taper, that midline of the back. Okay. Oh, my God. 
squad. Side of that rock, turn out those shoulders, the delts. Fifteen seconds, dig deep. Go on, five, four, two, one. One set, two to go. We got this. Remember, these are my workouts also. This is my full session for the day. What we're doing together is exactly what I'm going through also. Literally, a pair of dumbbells, pushing your body constantly, mixing up the routines. Absolutely loving it. Never have I been more consistent with my training. 20 seconds, let's go. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! One more set, then one more exercise for round one. Feeling good. In the barn, let's go. Try to get that 8 to 12, 8 to 15 reps. Oh, he swings alright. <clears throat> 10 seconds. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Lovely. Okay, last set of round 1 front lunges. So just alternating like that. Grab the weights, alternate. Go heavier, you can go light, you can go at your own pace. It's up to you, but you know what you have to do to push yourself. I'm telling you every step of the way. Whether it's trying to push out an extra few reps, or whether it's trying to lift that wee bit heavier weight. We're slowing the movement down, focusing on the perfect form, really focusing on the squeeze, the contraction. That's what it's all about. Ten seconds, let's go. It's those three sets, it's that extra set of each exercise really makes the difference. Ten seconds. Keep digging. Go on. Five, four, three, two. 
Last set of round one, then we're gonna chill out, grab a drink, and then get ready for the next set. Half exercise. Three, two, one. Down in glutes. Five, four, three, two, one. Good rest. Right squat, quick drink, absolutely brilliant work. I'll see you on round number two. Round number two squad, let's get into it. Five different exercises, three sets. Compound movements to really help us Build that lean muscle, sculpt off our physique, add that progressive overload and push forward. We're going to kick it off with pullover. So you're lying back on the ground, weight coming up, full extended over the head and back again. You can also do that on the edge of a bench, bring the weight up and over, okay? It's entirely up to you. Try to lift that heavier weight, okay? Let's try to hit that 8 to 15 rep range for 3 sets. We have our 15 second countdown to guide us now to get warmed up or sorry, to get ready for this next round. Get prepared and we're 40 on, 20 off. This is it. Last round, let's make it count. So here we go. If you want to make it harder, let's see you take that weight. You can lift your glutes up off the ground, increase the range of motion. Okay, and plus it's working the glutes in the core, so you're getting a wee bit more out of the one movement. Easy work. Good. Take a few seconds, then we go again. Also remember, if the timer goes 40 seconds, there's nothing stopping you adding an extra few reps in if you have it. Like you can literally work it up to 45 seconds or 50 and then just take an extra rest. You can work it any way you want, that's the power of these workouts. The timer is there just to gauge it, and it's there to try to push it in that 8 to 15 round range. Good. One more set of these. Push up like that. Right, ready? Let's go. Three, two, one. Easy. That was a good exercise, something that we don't do enough of in the workout. It's definitely going to be adding them pullovers. I used to add them in a lot, but we want to move forward doing them a lot more. Okay, the next one is shoulder press. So grab a weight where we can push ourselves around 8 to 15. Okay? Alright, let's go. 
I just admire, you don't need to have a full set of dumbbells to get brilliant results with these sessions. Literally, a few pairs in a mix between a heavier and a lighter pair. Oh, I feel the burn there. And even at that, you can grab one heavier weight and do a shoulder press with the one dumbbell, holding both, both hands holding the dumbbell above the head. That's all And there's three sets. You can grab the one weight up, press it. Okay, ready to go. Three, two, one. Literally 10 reps all I'm getting there. That's still good though. Doesn't matter even if you're only getting 8 or 9. That's it and you can't push out anymore so you know you're in that muscle building state. Right. 15 seconds of recovery and then we go again. Last set of shoulder press, let's go. <laughs> so what's all about, you see me struggling every rep alongside with you, not just faking through these sessions, I'm trying to push my body also. The more you push, the better the results. It's mad like, these 20 to 30 minute sessions, such good results. Our next exercise now for three sets is our RDLs, pushing back the glutes, dumbbells with one dumbbell, kettlebell come down, up, and continue pushing out the glutes, we bend in the hamstrings. Same thing, 8 to 15 compound exercises. Right, let's go. Good. Feel that my hamstring and my glutes. Bring an exercise in already out. Sweating here also. This isn't just about building muscle. You're in a fat burning state. Your nutrition is going to play a key role in whatever you want your goals to be. Right. Second set. Ten seconds. One more set. These RDLs. We're flying through. Right, three, two, one. Go. <sighs> 
10 seconds. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one. Brilliant. Right, three sets of curls, five sets of curls. Giving you three options. If you're using sort of lighter dumbbells, go like that. Okay, straight down, straight up, box and squeeze. If you're using a bit heavier, go one arm alternating each time. Or if you want to hit the biceps from a different angle, target more of this part of the bicep, hammer curls. So it's up to you. Let's go. <clears throat> Gonna go alternate. Ten seconds. Go on five, four, three, two, one. Good. Unreal work squad, let's just keep the momentum. Let's keep pushing forward. Three, two, one. Let's go, 10. Power through in our few reps. Brilliant. One more set of these curves, then we have one more exercise to finish off our 30 minute muscle builder. Right squad, let's go. <laughs> Come on, dig deep. Five, four, three, two, one. Right squad, this is it. Hit trust in the finish. Three sets. Now you can go on the ground like we normally do, or you can go on the edge of the bench, the chair, anything to increase the range of motion. Got a leg back, trust up. Okay? Right, let's go. Down and up. Easy work. Ten seconds. Go. Feel the burn in that. Woo. Take a recovery, 10 seconds. Right, ready to go again. Three, two, Try to keep looking in front. Go on. Three, two. That is brilliant.
Brooke. Right, we've got one more set of these. Such an effect of our studies, though, honestly, the glutes, uh, one of the largest muscle groups in the body. Add the progressive overload in, benefits your overall physique, not just that one specific area. Right, this is it. Squad, there it is. What a session. A 30 minute muscle building, sculpting session complete. Massive well done. Now, that's the first time we've done three sets now in a while within the studio. So, I really appreciate it. If you leave a comment below, let me know how you got on the session. If you enjoyed the three sets, I'll definitely put it in more often. Even if you didn't enjoy it as much as other sessions, you have to remember that sometimes those slower paced, more boring style workouts where it's just few exercises and you're doing three sets can be very effective for your overall body transformation, your strength and everything and then combine it with those other style of sessions. So I really do appreciate your feedback. Let me know if you want more of them. Tag me in your stories and I'll see you on the next session. 